Welcome back to the now Milwaukee. If a picture is worth a thousand words, two amateur photographers have unearthed volumes on Milwaukee's history. It's a chance find in a Bayview antique store that gives us a fascinating snapshot at how our city used to look. Think of this magnifying glass as a tiny time machine. You see the progression through the photos. If you put them in chronological order, there's a clear progression. For amateur photographers Adam Levin and Carl Bando, it's a tool to travel back to what Milwaukee used to be. It's an interesting look in how our city used to look, and it no longer looks like it anymore. The journey back to 1970s Milwaukee is a trip taken by accident. While rummaging through American estate antiques, they found a treasure hundreds of old Kodachrome slides capturing views this generation has never been able to see. To get the opportunity to see things that my grandparents saw, maybe that my great grandparents saw with their own eyes, you know, and get to kind of, in a way, walk in their footsteps and get to see the stuff in color. You know, it's, it's just incredible. Like this view from 3rd and Wisconsin in the 1970s. It's now Grand Avenue Mall and the Federal Building. Fourth and Wisconsin was once home to a budget rental car office. Today, it's the Wisconsin Center. And over the Milwaukee River, a crew is seen building the Wisconsin Avenue Bridge. Not that different all these years later. Yeah, that's, uh... For Leonard Budney, the owner of American Estates, these photos are more than history. They are his memories. I think of the past, and I think of uh, all the people that I used to know and uh, they don't come around anymore, either moved or died. After sitting in a box for three decades, these slides finally have meaning again. In the hands of a new generation of photographers, we can see just how far our city has come. Milwaukee back then looked more rustic. You certainly see that in the photos, the grittiness, the things aren't perfect. Our photojournalist Jeff Janka put that piece together for us. Thank you, Jeff. Those pictures all taken by Ray Chopere. He devoted more than 50 years of his life to taking pictures of Milwaukee. 25,000 of his other slides are already at the Milwaukee Historical Society.